Hi, this is Nick from Dynavistics, and this is a short video on how to set up and use customer quick reports in SalesPad. To get started, the first thing we need to do is open up the security editor and navigate to the customer quick report item. Next, let's create the quick report. I've got a generic quick report template here that I pulled from SalesPad's quick report documentation. I've pre-written a basic SQL query to pull the count of the number of times a customer has ordered an item. In order to have this quick report be automatically filtered by customer number in SalesPad, we need to change the add where property to true. This will just add the SQL where condition to the query and pass the current customer number in. I'm going to save the quick report into a quick reports folder on my PC. Keep in mind that you will need to specify the path to the quick reports file in SalesPad. Also, make sure to set the save as type to all files and add the .spreped at the end of the file name. All quick reports in SalesPad need to be saved as a .spreped file or they will not work. Now that we've created and saved our new quick report, let's specify the path to the new file in SalesPad under the quick report property in the security editor. In order for any security changes to be applied, we will need to save and then log out and log back in. Now, let's open up a customer card and take a look at the new quick report we've just created. Here is the new quick report. As you can see, it displays the item number and the number of times the customer has ordered any given item. Also notice that the quick report is only displaying information for the current customer we have open. Another thing to notice is that the Quick Report tab text shows Customer Quick Report Test. To change that, let's reopen the Quick Report we just created. The report name is what drives the Quick Report tab text within SalesPad. Let's update that text to something that makes more sense. Now the tab text is updated with the new report name text. So there you have it, we've just created a customer quick report. I hope you've enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more tips and tricks for SalesPad.